Hey, it's Tim, and welcome back to another episode of Income TV. Today, we're going to talk about the daily habits of successful people. So, what are the habits common to successful people? What are the things successful people do habitually? These are some of the questions people have asked me several times. According to Aristotle, 95% of everything one does is the outcome of habit. The standard rule, therefore, is for you to form good habits, make the habits your masters, and don't give room for bad habits. Another thing is that it's difficult to form good habits, but they are easy to live with. It's easy to form bad habits, but they are difficult to live with. One great thing I've discovered with the help of psychology is that both good habits and bad habits can be learned and unlearned. In the real sense, you do not unlearn a habit, but you replace it with another habit. For instance, a bad habit is replaced with a good habit that is more powerful and impactful. Now, how is a good habit developed? It's simply by repetition. Nearly all the actions you take daily, right from when you wake up in the morning, are a habit. Let me give you some of the best habits. The first best habit is goal setting and orientation. So what's the meaning of this? It's simply thinking about your goals for the next day while preparing to sleep at night. Write down the little goals you are to accomplish for each day. You should also have a journal of your goals and make sure you keep it safe. And whatever you do, either driving, talking, or even eating, always think about your goals. The truth is that you're a product of your thoughts. You will always achieve the goals you think about every time. This is the secret of all successful and wealthy people. They think about their goals more than any other thing. The second best habit is results orientation. One common thing among results oriented people is that they always think about what they can do or implement to get the best results. Successful people will always list all the things they must do and set priorities on them before implementation. You need to do certain things before you can become result oriented. Bring out your list for the day and ask yourself, if I'm given a month to do just one task on this list, which task would I choose? After picking a task, mark it and start working on it immediately. You must discipline yourself to work continuously and tirelessly until that particular task has been completed. This particular technique has helped people to move from poverty to wealth across the globe. Now is the time for you to pick the most vital task on your list. Start working on it immediately and discipline yourself to continuously and relentlessly work on it until you complete it. People orientation is another habit you should have. You need to understand that you need the support, help, and cooperation of other people to achieve anything in life. You should always ask yourself, what do people need and want from me? In what areas can I assist other people for them to assist me in return? For example, top salespeople are concerned about their customers and they think about them always. Top salespeople always wanna know who their customers are, what they want, how to best help them, and how they can help them better than before. Successful people in their relationship with people focus mainly on the most important or valuable people in their personal and business worlds. Health orientation is another must have it. Your health is something you should think about always. Think about exercising your body every day. Think about eating less but better food. You should also think about getting enough rest. Don't forget that you need much more energy to remain successful in this world. You can only get the required amounts of energy by getting enough rest, eat healthy foods, and exercising your body daily. You should also have the habit of honesty. Ensure you tell the truth always regardless of what it would cost you. Finally, you need to have the habit called self-discipline. This particular habit tends to be the foundation habit that other things are built upon. Self-discipline could be best defined as the ability to make oneself do what should be done at the appropriate time, whether it's convenient or not. Of course, anybody can do it if the urge is there. However, self-discipline is about doing it when you actually don't feel like it or have the urge to do it. What is that particular valuable, helpful habit that you need to start developing now to achieve your most vital goals? Start practicing the habit until it becomes a part of you. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to leave a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, be sure to click the circular image in the upper right hand corner of the screen and tick the bell icon to get notified whenever we release more new videos to help you increase your income. Go ahead and check out some additional money making videos right now on the left side of the screen.
If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.